Hi everyone, we're back and we're going to be doing the second uh, section of the uh, of the lamp, of the Shabby Shake lamp. Um, I got out of myself a little bit of headache again of myself and uh, and I went and put on this trim. I want you to see it because it's absolutely gorgeous. Can you see that? Uh, I got this trim from uh, Creating with Detail Store from May Larson and she sent that to me. That was so sweet of her and I just love it. It's just absolutely what I needed to finish up this lamp. Uh, it has a little bit of uh, discoloration, not much really, but a little bit here and there and it's okay because actually it makes the lamp look older and I like that and it is a vintage by the way this is vintage and I talked to her today and she does have still a little bit of it and I know she'll let you have it for a real reasonable price so you know give it a holler email her whatever and um, you know she'll tell you more about it anyway as I say I got myself a little bit ahead and uh, I went and put it on in here okay, all the way around it and then right in here on those three corners right in here and right right over here so what we're gonna do now is go ahead and finish up this side in here and then I'll show you how I finish on this end okay all right I hope you're doing good I'm doing fantastic and uh, really excited to be here uh, it's it's been like I said a long a long 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 process to do so but it's gonna be okay uh, and also learning how to put this uh, videos for uploading and all of that which I'm very new with I'm not a computer savvy whatsoever so a little by little we'll get it in there uh, it may not be a perfect video, but I feel like you will get to, to know what I'm doing. Okay, see, we just hot glue it, and it just looks so pretty. Oh, I just love it. Love it, love it, love it. Thank you, man. This is, like I said, this has been like a, the cherry on the cake. Uh, I wasn't expecting to use anything like this, but when it came, I just knew. I just knew where it was going to go. Oh, I love it, love it. I did give it two coats of polyurethane all over around it, which it makes it, oops, excuse me, I have this on the top of the Pringle can so that I can turn it around. But I don't know if you can tell the shininess of it. See how pretty? It, it looks like glass. And that's the effect that I wanted to achieve, to look like stained glass. And uh, I could not ask for more. I mean, it's just... It's just exactly what I wanted. And I got the gloss. I didn't get the, um, the semi gloss. I wanted the gloss. And like I said, the uh, lace is still looks just like the lace was, but the, uh, the lampshade itself, like I said, it looked just like glass. Okay, let's see. Let me put this a little bit farther back, a little bit, so y'all can see it. Because I'm filming with my iPod, uh, and I didn't know that, but I love my iPod, uh, it's taken a long time uh, to, uh, to upload. And so this is why I'm gonna have to do my tutorials and, you know, in more than one section, but that's okay. Uh, I will have them process and then just put them both at the same time so you won't be able to miss anything. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cut here. Let's see. Whoops, excuse me. I'm gonna go ahead and cut right. Uh, I wanna cut this little dangle. Well, let's see if I can, maybe not. I think I'm gonna have to cut right, right here, okay? And then that way, 
Okay, ready to go. And then I'll just cut this little bit of it. Now, let's see if I can see it. I hope you can see it too. Right, okay. See this little bit here? That's what I want to cut right. Oops. Right there. So I'll have a dangle in there, okay? And now, oops, I guess I missed a dangle. Sorry, that's all right. We'll just cut it off. No big deal. It's probably going to want to show anyway. And I have another one here. Right. So I'm going to put this one here. Right there. And then I'm going to come back. But first I'm going to put a little bit of glue right there where I'm going to, uh, to cut. And then that way, there we go. Now we got it. And then we're just gonna glue the rest of it and it's gonna be awesome. Okay, right where I wanted it. There we go. See? Now on this particular lamp, and it's been really great, I started with a loop right here and it's been awesome. In every corner, I was able to do a loop without forcing it or anything. See? And so it's great. So in other words, most, and most lamps are very symmetrical as far as the, you know, the, the measurement and everything. So if you have an idea what you wanna end up in here on the corners, then go ahead and start with that. I did the loop because what I'm going to do next is uh, I want some that. I'll tell you what I'm going to do next. I'm going to go ahead and take this green thread that is in here on the uh, branch. Can you see it? It's kind of a green thread. Okay, we're going to take it off. And I never know which side of the... Uh, of which end, you know, it's going to unravel because this is a chain stitch. So I'm going to try it in here. And if that doesn't work, that I know is the other side, okay? Let's see. And it doesn't, okay, well that's all right, no problem. All right, let's try the other one. Let's see what this one is. Oh yeah, look at here. It just does its thing. It just, look, oh my goodness, look how pretty that looks. Okay, let me take it all off. Oh, wow. See, when you take it off, you really, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, that's awesome. Can you see that? Oh my goodness. It is so beautiful. So this is what I got. Now, what I wanted to do to this, let me put this back up, please. What I wanted to do now is bring the gold on here. So what I did, I found this um, dangling and uh, a tassel, excuse me, a tassel. Um, it was two in a package at Hobby Lobby. Unfortunately, I lost one package somewhere. It could be while I was shopping or anyway, I didn't get home with it. I know I put two in my card, but somehow or other, uh, I think it probably fell off the card. It could possibly happen. So I'm gonna have to wait to finish the other ones with, with a tassel. But you're still gonna get the effect of the look of the whole lamp finish. So we're gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. And these are beautiful. Look at this, oh my goodness. Isn't it gorgeous? And the color is perfect. It is just perfectly, isn't it beautiful? So what I'm going to do is go ahead and uh, just put one right here so it will hang down and just put some glue and just have it in there and that's it. There we go, whoops. And with my handy dandy here, which by the way, <laughs> this is a spatula from Pampers Chef, but it does the work. So hey, I didn't need it for anything else, so it's working great for my glue. 
Okay, here we go. And I'm gonna go ahead and open that up in here and then maybe put a little bit more on either side of the, uh, of this little core, okay? There we go. And there we go. Maybe a little bit more in here. Okay, now look at that. Oh goodness gracious. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. And so we're gonna do the same thing in this side. Let's see, can you see it? I want you to see what I'm doing right here. Okay, and there it goes. There we go, okay. And we're gonna go ahead and put that on there. And that's that. Oh, look at that. Isn't it gorgeous? Love it. I'm, I get excited, by the way. You're going to learn that uh, when I do things and I like it, I get really excited and I get happy. And really, that's the way it should be. If you don't approach it, I don't care what it is. Get excited about it, you know? you, you it, It's what you did. It's what, how you did it. Okay, now we're going to put some flowers, but I got to go ahead and have to go ahead and, and uh, glue this little right in stone right there okay and there we go i thought those were really pretty i got these little flowers in a um in a hair band in walmart i think there were five in there and so these are perfect i'm not a really i mean i, I know i can put some flowers in here bigger and whatever but like i said uh sometimes less is more so um I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the corners right here, and that's why I take care of this area. All right, and look at this. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. All right, there we go. And we're gonna do the same in here. This one right there. Oh goodness. Oh wow. Oh wow wow. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. So here's my lampshade. As I said, the only thing I need is to get two more tussles and put it on the other side. And of course, go ahead and uh, put the little flowers on. But I'm gonna wait to put these flowers until I can put the tassel on. Now, if you'll excuse me for just a sec, I'm gonna run and get a lamp. Uh, you know, stand just so you can look at it and see what it looks like. It seems like every video I'm doing, I have to run and do something. So maybe it's my trademark. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in. And a lamp stand now the shade is not gonna go into this lamp uh, a stand okay I just wanted you to see it in the lamp to give you an idea you know what it looks like and then I'm going to raise up the uh, the video let me get this out of the way and get the uh, oops get this done and then get the light bulb Just to give you an idea what it looks like, because it's absolutely beautiful. The light's just, uh... okay, let's see if I can raise this up. Excuse me for just a sec. Okay. Alrighty, let's see. I don't know if I can get that. Hold it, hold it for me. Let's just see, it's as high as it's gonna get. Well, afraid that it's not gonna do it but anyway here is my lamp it's absolutely gorgeous 
and I hope you give it a try. It's just, it's been a lot of fun making it. And it really, you know, once we get started, it, it really didn't take that long. I know I got ahead of myself on the, on the first video too, because I didn't know how long it was gonna take me to actually, you know, glue down the appliques and such. But I think you get the idea. And if you want a videos that are more in detail, just let me leave me a comment and I'll be happy to then, you know, uh, try to do that for you. But sometimes if I can just get, you know, do some things ahead, uh, there are no things that you're going to mess much up anyway, but uh, oh, here we go. Okay. It's just, I mean, it's such a pretty lamp. I, I just can't wait. Uh, to actually um, actually get it and uh, and put it on my floor lamp uh, floor stand that I'm going to do is going to have I'm just going to lay it down here for just a sec. Let's see. Here we go. Um, it's gonna it's gonna be about this gold uh, color. The stand. It's also a, an antique. And so I can't wait to put it all together, so to, you know, and, and see how it's going to look. But I think it's going to be gorgeous, and uh, uh, I'm really proud of what I, you know, achieved. And um, and I hope you give it a try. So until next time, uh, be well, stay crafty, and God bless you.